All right, welcome to Verb Preach Radio, Everyday People the Movie. Look, uh, I'd like to thank everybody that came out to the Palms in the formal market that purchased t-shirts and movies. And also, I'd like to thank the people that will be uh, meeting us at the Shrine. Uh, when we're back at the Shrine, i let you all know. But we'll be at Acres Home Farmers Market this uh, coming up Saturday. Uh, so be there. Get your copy of Everyday People the Movie. Why did we do Everyday People the Movie, a, a docudrama? First of all, uh, this movie was done. Um, I wrote the movie, the docudrama, and it's something that I want to do to show the world that we do have talent in Houston, and we'd like the film industry to come to Houston. So we put our best foot forward. Um, um, certain things that, let's say, a um, Hollywood or New York or Atlanta, uh, with their ex expertise, um, might, and I say might, could come in and enhance what we're doing in Houston, but since Houston has been neglected on the film stage, we're learning how to do everything on, on our own to where we can set a movie uh, that we produced right out of Houston and set it right next to something that was done in Hollywood. So it's trial and error phase. This is the first, this is not gonna be the last everyday people of the movie. I'd like to thank uh, Terrence White Comedian Terry Shh, for being in the movie, you know what I mean, and helping enhance it with his skills, acting skills. It got a lot of great people in this movie. Y'all make sure y'all check it out. Everyday people, the movie, the docu drama. Now, what is it all about? That's what everybody wants to know. What is it all about? Everyday people, the movie encompasses the struggle of black men and women in today's society to progress and be the best individuals that they can be because there's always an obstacle or something trying to pull you back in the fray. As they stated, uh, uh, the crab in the bucket syndrome. This movie, a docudrama, will not only remove the crab in the bucket um, syndrome, but it'll also give you an insight on how to project your mind into the future so you can go into that future and uh, achieve, and it will give you the tools necessary that you need to achieve your dreams and goals at the at the face of adversity. When when you got so you got look in this docudrama, you have the police coming at the activists because they're stating that the activists are cleaning up the streets, which is cutting into their overtime money because the. Uh, the officers, they need people out on that street committing crime to justify their jobs and their overtime. Then you got the you got the drug dealers who said, hey, activists, you clean up these streets, you take my young soldiers out the street, who gonna move my product? I, I done made so much money, I'm not getting back on the street level and start working my way back up to the top again. We need to get rid of the activists, get out the way, y'all disturbing the money. And basically, the activists are saying, look, man, it's bigger than police. And it's bigger than uh, the money that's made from drug sales. It's actually about creating what our ancestors instilled in us to produce in the future for future generations. It's actually putting our mindset to create something so wonderful as the pyramids that our ancestors created 3000 6000 10000 all up to 50000 years ago. You know, we actually want to take that mindset and produce something solid, a solid foundation while we still around, while we on this planet at this present time. So the police situation is a distraction. Drug dealing is a distraction because time that is wasted in dealing with these two, we could be unlocking codes and uh, plotting a, a per because let me put it like this our attention is not focused on this planet in this universe we neglecting the planet our attention is focused on everything other than nature which grows us you know you 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 put your energy into nature nature will put its energy into you you take your energy out of nature nature will take its energy out of you and you have what we have today so this docudrama 
will inspire so many people to want to get out there and explore. So many people that want to be become activists. So many people that just want to say, hey, man, let me build up in my community. Or so many people that just say, hey, man, let's sit down and have a cipher. We'll sit down and talk and discuss issues that's affecting our, our daily lives. Uh, white supremacy, white racism, white uh, nationalism, white nationalist uh, is all with intertwined within this docudrama. We were speaking on this issue before what took place in El Paso and what took place in Ohio. But the mindset of white supremacy is a, how can I put it? It's a um, mental illness. You would have to attach a mental Ill illness to the term white nationalist Simply because a, a, a white nationalist commits acts of crime and violence against a, a minority person or a melanated being, but has no foundation to justify why he is um, administering such acts of hate and violence towards the um, melanated or what we deem minority people. He can't justify. He don't, if you ask him why, he say, well, they taking over our planet. We've been on a planet before you got here, so what are you talking about? I mean, what what, what, what root, uh, is your ideology based on any type of math or science? I mean, they be pulling out the air. They be grasping for straw. I don't like black people because of this. And some of it, though, black people, gotta be honest with you, some of it is for you sell out Negroes who go to white folks and try to tell white folks, uh, you see them black people over there, you gotta watch them and see these black people over here, they you think you doing them a service and they looking at you like, I don't like none of y'all. So look, the Negro days is over. Either you gonna stand up, be a man, be a woman, love yourself in your community. And remember that it's all shades in the black family. I mean we 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 got the best of both worlds. So enjoy life, have fun. Uh Get you a copy, Everyday People, the movie, docudrama, and, and, and work with us as we present uh, this first docudrama. But it was film shot right here in H-Town. So support. And we are here.